Okay, so in this uh, drizzling episode of Gav Details, we're working on a Honda Ridgeline. So the truck has been uh, washed, uh, decontaminated with both Iron X and the NanoSkin handy towel. So uh, because it's starting to drizzle here, I'm not going to use Beadmaker to get us through until the actual full detail. We'll be using the NanoLex wash coat on pretty much an unprotected vehicle. Uh, I do have a video that showed the use of the Nanolex on my Camaro which has a ceramic coating on it so it's just kind of a a foam on uh, topper or booster type product so I'll be able to monitor how well the wash coat holds up on a vehicle that uh, will be coming back to me uh, soon for a full detail. So as you can see the water pretty much just sits on the fender uh, it starts to sheet very slowly same thing on the hood starts to separate a little bit but for the most part the panels are flat so we're gonna set up the camera and fill the Amazon foam cannon with about 850 milliliters of water and then 100 milliliters or roughly four ounces of the Nanolex wash coat and then we are going to foam the truck. So here we are, the Nanolex wash coat. We're going to foam it on. We're only going to let it dwell on the surface for two to three minutes and then we're going to rinse off and then we should see some more hydrophobic properties, beading and sheeting of the water, and then we're pretty much just going to towel dry the truck. So again, you can hear the product fizzing. I would assume to some extent that would be the, the chemical bonding. Uh, like I said, leave it on two to three minutes, rinse off, and hopefully we have some um, you know, short-term protection with beading and sheeting of the water. And uh, like I said, the vehicle will be coming back to me for a full detail. Uh, we'll inspect the paint, uh, light to medium polishing, and then likely uh, Wolfgang deep gloss paint sealant because outside of Beadmaker, that is the slickest product that I have ever used. Okay, so the truck's fully rinsed. You can see uh, it does add beading and it sheets the water pretty well. So uh, I'm going to show how slick the surface is using the modified Ego blower.
So, a little bit of added gloss, a little bit of added protection uh, on the short term, and uh, should be ease of washing, rinsing, and drying on the next few washes. So, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up, and for more detailing videos, please hit the subscribe button. Thanks.